Good afternoon, Cool Beans. Today, we are going to talk about the way that we end sentences. Typically, a sentence gets ended in three main ways or with three different punctuation marks. We have our period, our exclamation point, and our question mark. So, let's talk about when we use our period. We use the period at the end of a sentence that declares something or makes a statement. For instance, you can end the sentence with a period when you say, I want to go to school. I'm not saying anything with excitement. I'm not asking you a question. I'm telling you, I want to go to school. So we would end that with our period. Now, when we use the exclamation point, we're using it to show some form of excitement. Like, oh no, my car, my baby's locked in a car. Or, no, that wasn't the most fun excitement, but... It's excitement nonetheless. Or, a surprise party for me? That's another time you end a sentence with an exclamation point. Remember, excitement isn't always a good thing. It's just showing some sort of strong feeling or emotion. Or we can even end a sentence with a question mark. And when we use the question mark, what are we doing? We're asking a question. That's right. Your question could be, do I have to eat that for dinner? Or, can my friends come over to play, please? You're asking somebody something. And the thing to remember with a question mark is, if you're asking someone with a question, it usually requires an answer. So if you need an answer to something, then you know that sentence would end in a question mark. All right, so let's put some of these punctuation marks to the test. Are you ready? Okay, let's begin. Okay, everyone. Now we're going to look at three sentences and determine whether or not we are going to end the sentence in a period, a question mark, or an exclamation point. Now keep in mind that we end our sentence with a period when we are declaring something or making a statement. We end our sentence with a question mark when we are asking a question, and we end our sentence with an exclamation point when we are showing some form of excitement. Are you ready? Okay, let's begin. Our first sentence is, she is my friend. Again, can we read that? Our sentence says, she is my friend. So, what punctuation mark would we use at the end of that sentence? Hmm, let's think about it. When we say, she is my friend, are we asking a question? No. I'm not asking, is she my friend? I'm saying, she is my friend. Are we showing excitement about something? No, I wouldn't say we're showing excitement to use the exclamation point. Are we maybe telling somebody something or declaring something? Yes, we're making a statement. We're declaring that she is my friend. So which punctuation mark says a statement or makes a declaration? That's right, our period does that. So we would end this sentence with a period. Good job. She is my friend. All right, sentence number two. This one says, help, my house is on fire. Oh my, let's read that one again. Help, my house is on fire. Hmm, how would we end that sentence? Am I just saying to you, help, my house is on fire. Am I just declaring it? No, I don't think I'm saying that. Not, at least not in that way. Am I saying, help, my house is on fire. Am I asking a question? No, I'm not asking anyone is my house on fire. I'm telling you, help, my house is on fire. And last but not least, am I using excitement when I'm saying that? Oh yes, I am definitely using excitement to tell you that my house is on fire. Remember, excitement doesn't have to be a good thing in this sentence or a bad thing, it's just showing some form of excitement. Help, my house is on fire. That's right, so I think that for that one, we need our exclamation point. Because I am definitely showing excitement when I say, help, my house is on fire. Let's move that up some. And then for our last sentence, we're saying, may I play with your toy? Again, let's read that again. May I play with your toy? Hmm. For that one... Am I showing excitement with that exclamation point? No, that's not really something to show excitement for. 
Am I just declaring something or making a statement? May I play with your toy? No. But am I asking a question? Am I asking a question? I believe I am. I am saying, may I play with your toy? I'm asking you, may I play with your toy? I'm asking you a question. So, we would end that sentence in a question mark. That's right. So, let's review our three sentences one more time. The first sentence was, she is my friend. I'm just making a statement. I'm telling you, I'm declaring something, telling you she is my friend. So, I ended that one in a period. For sentence number two, I said, help, my house is on fire. Help, my house is on fire. Yes, I had to show a lot of excitement for that sentence. So we use our exclamation point. And for our third sentence, may I play with your toy? I'm asking something. I'm asking, may I play with your toy? So we ended that sentence in a question mark. Very good. Did you guys get all three of those sentences correct with their ending punctuation? If not, that's okay, because you can always watch it again later. Cool Beans out.